You know, first of all, we say it's a strategy, not a program. Community school is not a program. It's made up of lots of programs and lots of services and lots of opportunities, but it's not a program. And it's important because, uh, especially I've, I've realized when I talk to groups of teachers at schools, and if I say to them, we have a brand new program, right? You know, the eyes sort of roll back in their heads, and it's like, here we go again, a new program. Um, it really is a strategy that's made up of many different kinds of inputs, um, and is very much dependent upon uh, the particular needs of that particular community, and, and of course the assets and the opportunities there as well. So it, you'll, you'll notice that every community school looks different, and that's the way it's supposed to be. It should really be a reflection of what's, what's happening locally. So she described it as a strategy for organizing the resources of the community around student success. And when we heard that, we said, we need to write that down. That makes a lot of sense. Um, there is a clear result here. We're not just doing this for the sake of you know, providing service delivery, right? Even though that's a part of the work. Um, the real point here is to have a targeted, organized, integrated um, process to bring all these different elements together to support student success. If we're not doing that, there's no point in doing this work in schools. Just do community center stuff, right? Um, why do this in schools if it's not the real point of all this work? So student success is really what it's all about. So that's, that's the first definition. The second one comes to us from the Coalition for Community Schools. Mission. I like it a lot. Um, I think it's, it probably took a long time to get to this point to make it sort of so polished. Um, I have to say, though, I have not memorized it. Uh, as much as I try, I really haven't memorized it. So uh, we at the National Center have the cocktail party version, too. Um, which is that it's, it's characterized by extended services, extended hours, and extended relationships. Okay? Um, so it's both about thinking that a school um, can be a place where more than just instruction takes place. Um, it could also be a place where you learn um, how to play the violin. Uh, it can also be a place where you get a, a flu shot. Uh, it's a place where a parent can, can, can learn to sort of write a really strong resume and you know, sort of redo the resume. Um, where, where kids can stay on, on a weekend um, and do some really hardcore leadership development stuff as well. All of these things are, are possible in a community school. So we're sort of, you know, op we're opening up what a, a community school can do, what a school can do. Um, so lots of different services. And you can imagine that it's really hard to do all that stuff within the traditional confines of a school day, you know, 8 to 3 or whatever. So we also have to think about longer time, longer day, a longer week, a longer year, okay? And a, and a lot of our schools in New York, we're open six days a week uh, from 7 to 10 p.m., 7, 7 a.m. To, uh, to 10 p.m. Not every single school does this. Um, and even uh, eight weeks in the summertime for a 10-hour day, uh, we're also open. So really thinking about how time is, is a big part of the conversation as well. And then finally, the extended relationships. It's also about a school recognizing that there's no way that the school alone can do all the things that kids need, right? So we have to bring in community partners into the school that bring, that sort of bring a certain expertise, uh, that bring a particular um, uh, you know, service that's very much needed. Um, so opening up the doors, inviting the community in like a swinging door, but also the school looking out to the community as a context for learning, right? The community, the neighborhood is a part of what we need to understand and help kids to understand. Um, so it's that swinging door in a community school that really makes it different than a traditional school. Does this make sense? Yes.